Hello, I'm Kyle, and welcome back to Bedtime Verses with Kyle. Just a little poetry to help you get ready for bed. Tonight we have some more Philip Sidney, a couple more short poems, uh, Petrarchs or um, sonnets. The one is called To the Sad Moon, and the other is called Desire. Okay, here we go. With how sad steps, O moon, thou climbst the skies, how silently, and with how wan a face, what? May it be that even in heavenly place, that busy archer his sharp arrows tries? Sure, if that long with love acquaintance eyes can judge of love, thou feel'st a lover's case. I read it in thy looks, thy languished grace, to me that feel the like thy state descries. Then, even of fellowship, O moon, tell me, in constant love deemed there but want of wit, are beauties there as proud as here they be? Do they above love to be loved, and yet... Those lovers scorn whom that love doth possess? Do they call virtue there ungratefulness? Oh, more scorn lover stuff. He had a real rough time of it. <laughs> These fellows. Okay, uh, now to desire. Thou blind man's mark, thou fool's self-chosen snare, fond fancy scum and dregs of scattered thought, band of all evils, cradle of causeless care, Thou web of will, whose end is never wrought. Desire, desire, I have too dearly bought, With price of mangled mind thy worthless wear. Too long, too long asleep thou hast me brought, Who should my mind to higher things prepare. But yet in vain thou hast my ruin sought, In vain thou mad'st me to vain things aspire, In vain thou kindlest all thy smoky fire. For virtue hath this better lesson taught, within myself to seek my only hire, desiring not but how to kill desire. Because he's had a few rough nights. Very Buddhist of him. Thanks again for joining me for Bedtime Verses with Kyle. You can follow me here or subscribe to my website or my YouTube and there'll be new videos every weekday night at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Good night, sleep tight. <laughs>